You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Linda, your host, and today I have Jeff Miller from Signature Healthcare. Jeff's been on the show before. Welcome, Jeff. Nice Thank to see you. Thank you, Mark. Thanks for having me again. I'm always glad, always glad to promote the great events that Signature Healthcare does. Thank and you. this is one of the big ones. It, it is, is the gala, the foundation gala on December 1st. And who are you going to honor this year? So, this is our annual Ring of Champions dinner, as we call it. And we're honoring Beverly Papasaris, the president of the Brockton VNA. Beverly's uh, such an important person in the community and uh, as you know the VNA does great work, helps people receive uh, health care in their homes after they get out, usually after they get out of the hospital and uh, it's, a great, it's a great service. Now I understand you can get tickets up until the day before but you, you can. would prefer <laughs> that that not be the case, that they let you know ahead of time. How That's would right. people find out about ticket information, cost? I'm sure yeah. you've got a website or a section yeah. of the website or something. Yeah, certainly. Um, you can call 508-941-7179 and talk to Darlene. Mm -hmm. Or you can go to signature-healthcare.org and you can access all the information there. Okay. And basically it is a, you know, it's a dinner it's an, kind of an award ceremony. Yeah. I, I, I remember from going in the past that, you know, it's kind of, in a way, a recognition of the people that work at Signature as well. Yeah, yeah so basically the evening uh, starts off usually with, uh, with our president and CEO, Kim Holland, giving a message about the great accomplishments of Signature Healthcare during the year. And then this year we will hear from Dr. Mark Garnick, Mm -hmm. who is uh, from Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center. He's overseeing the uh, comprehensive cancer care program that BI is bringing down here to, to Brockton. And then we'll, we'll hear from Dr. Rolf Freider, who is the medical oncologist who will be in charge of the, of the program. And then after that, we get into the, uh, the fun part of the night, which is the actual recognition of Beverly. We'll have uh, somebody saying a few words about Beverly. And then we have a couple of surprises for Beverly during, during the evening, and we present her with the President's Medal for Community Service. That's nice. Um, the VNA is pretty seamless with the hospital because once people are in the hospital, then they have to go home and they need follow-up care. They need, you know, OT and PT and that's, that's right. you name it. And uh, they're, they're, they're a nonprofit like you are. They are. Yeah. So work, work hand in hand. And, for some reason, I think they're in the same age category as the hospital. I think they're in their 120 something. Yeah, I don't know how long they've been in existence, but it's been it's been for so for it's quite been a, a good long partnership. Time. Yeah, yeah. For all it's, these been, years. it's been a very good partnership, and it, it it still is a very good partnership. So, you know, when people are in the hospital and uh, they they are sent home and they need they're homebound and they they can't drive or they they need services, then the BNA comes in and and really works with them and does telemonitoring of the patients to make sure their vital signs are good and that they're staying on track while they're at home and they visit them on a regular basis. So it's a really, it's a really great partnership. Where's the event being held? The event is being held at the Shaw Center. Okay. It starts at, it's on December 1st, that's a Thursday night. Mm -hmm. It's the same time every year. We have it the first Thursday in December every year. Right. It starts at 6 p.m. Yeah. 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. is cocktails. Tickets are $125 if anyone's interested. As, as I said, they can uh, call Darlene at, at 508-941-7179 or visit our website, signature-healthcare.org. And uh, basically, it, it's, it, I mean, it's a really packed event. From what I remember, it is. you fill the place. Yeah. It's been at Massasoit Conference Center before. It's been in different locations, but it's the Shaw Centers now. But I mean, it's filled to capacity. Yeah, there'll be there. about 350 people in the in the Shaw Center, and if you've been there, you know that when there's that many people, it's a it's a full it's a full room, which is nice. Yeah, which Be is really nice. Beverly's certainly deserving of the of the recognition for what she's done for the residents of the Greater Brockton area through her involvement with the VNA. Now, talk for a minute. You mentioned it: the whole Beth Israel Deaconess connection with comprehensive cancer care. We all know driving into Boston is not a fun thing. Yep. Okay, and parking in Boston is even less of a fun That's thing. That's right, Mark. Luckily, we don't have the president-elect living in Boston like he plans to do in New York, uh, or at least <laughs> his wife right. anyway, and it's not gridlock, but traffic and stuff. 
How important is it to bring the cancer care home to the greater Brockton area? Yeah, I think it's one of the most important things that Signature Healthcare has done in a, in a very long time because you said it. People who have cancer to receive the comprehensive care right now, they have to go to an academic medical center in, in Boston. So yeah, we offer, we offer radiation oncology in, in, in Brockton mm -hmm. and the chemotherapy is done out in the community, but there's no one, one center, I would say a center of excellence where everything is coordinated. So in our new center, we'll have medical oncology and radiation oncology in the same building under one roof and the, there'd be shared exam spaces for the patients and the doctors. So a communication between a radiation oncologist and a medical oncologist can happen in an instant and we'll have patient navigators there working with patients to make sure that they're getting connected to the right services in the community. And that is under construction right now? That's under construction right now. The actual time frame that we've been told by the developers that that will be ready is September of 2017. Mm -hmm. We have uh, renovated some space within the hospital and we hired Dr. Rolf Freider uh, who was uh, trained by Dana Faber in, in the past and he is at our center now seeing patients so that when we open the center, we'll be, we'll be off and running. And it's dealing with any type of cancer, basically. Any type of cancer, okay. right. Okay, and the Beth Israel Deaconess name is a great name. It's a very well-respected name. Works arm in arm with Signature Healthcare. That's so right. right here in Greater Brockton, I remember years ago talking about cancer treatment in, in, in Brockton, both hospitals yep. talking yep. about doing it. Now it's now it's come now it's coming to reality. Yep. yep, the comprehensive care will be a reality very soon. Okay. So anything else you want to say about the gala? The, I got the, the one minute cue. Yeah. Well if you have some time, you know, come on out and, and join us to to honor Beverly. It's going to be a, a really fun night. And if you can join us, come on and do so. Okay, I appreciate it. Thanks for coming Thank on. Thank you, Mark. We'll Thanks for having me. We'll promote your next again. event and just keep up the good work at Signature. You too. Keep up your, doing what you're doing in the community. You're a very valuable resource, and we appreciate you having us here. Well, we love working with you. Thank you. Uh, you're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.